Brem, 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 brem. Welcome everyone. Guys, I'm going to show you a very nice trick how you get 50% infantry attack. Which you normally, you can only get if you're attacking structures. You, but you get some open field. If you use Parkal Herald or Harald Parker. Let's just call it the future. I'm not calling it differently, okay? Let me just showcase what happens here. This, uh, first of all, is a proof that it works. And Vosa has pointed this out to me. Greetings and thanks to K1872. Really appreciate it. And let's straight dive into it. Now, if you use this trick, you can get infantry attack with Parkal Herald, open field. But uh, there is a little bit of a workaround. Let me show you how it works. So, I don't have Parkal. I only have Herald. But, um, for showcase purpose, it's gonna work. Now, Parkal has skill number three. This is what we're talking about. When attacking strongholds or cities, you get 40% infantry attack bonus. On Herald, it's 10% skill number two. Yeah, 10% here. Yeah. Totally, it's 50%. It's working the same. You can just read it when attacking strongholds or cities. Uh, if, if I can trigger this on Herald, uh, you know it's working on Herald and Park. If you have some, okay? I only have Herald. So, what I do and what you have to do is... Let's just assume we're attacking a troop, just using the barb now. Yellow arrow. Attack again. Yellow arrow. Attack again. And I click the yellow arrow again. Now you can trigger this by just clicking the yellow arrow. It's crazy, but I'm not sure the game thinks you're attacking a structure. Let's uh, check this report. We can, we have to look for infantry attack 2% on the left side. Infantry attack 1%, no, that's not her, 3%. Then we have 1 plus 2. Viking battle axe, when attacking strongholds and cities. Like what? Yeah, you can see it works. Now, there is something we have to talk about, like conditional, but uh, you can see always when I'm clicking the yellow arrow, it's triggering. Again, 3%. For two rounds, one round. And the last one should also cause it again. For two rounds, because I clicked the yellow arrow. Now, yeah, I mean you're causing less damage if you're retreating. Yes, I got this, but... And I can check this one too. Here's a situation where this is very, very important. If you're fighting in a murder ball situation, this means you go in, you attack something, you go back. Now you have to use a yellow arrow. Do not use drag and drop. Let's say this barb is a murder ball here, level 51, okay? You attacking something, now they're attacking you and you're retreating. Do not use this if you have Parkal Herald or Harald Parkal. Uh, Harald Parkal, wow. It's not Parkal. Okay, if you do this, it's not gonna work. What you have to do is you have to click the yellow arrow. Now he has 50%. If he's getting attack, attacked, his counterattack damage is also getting increased. Because plus 50% attack. Now for this round, he's getting attacked now. Because I clicked the yellow button. He got all this 50%, which is normally should be, but we're going to see 2%. Infantry attack on the left side, look at it. 2%. It would be 50% if you have all max. This is crazy and very useful in a murder ball situation. So guys, future, do not use drag and drop. If you have Harald, Parkal, Parkal, Harald, use a yellow arrow to retreat. Because if they're still attacking you, and this is most uh, of the times the case, you have this nice 50% infantry attack up, which is giving you higher counterattack. Uh, I'm not sure it's intended. It works like this. I also have not tested more here. Guys, you can test it out. If you find something different or a better use of this, let me know in the comments down below. I just want to keep it a short one. Nice future. Guys, if you enjoyed this, smash the like button and uh, consider subscribing. By the way, Sunday we have Osiris League Finals. Don't miss it. See you on the next one. Brem, 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 brem. Nice Lambo, by the way.